Breathing wood smoke and vehicle exhaust is harmful for your health because they are loaded with tiny harmful particles, also known as fine particles. I'm Sean Lundblad with the Washington State Department of Ecology's Air Quality Program. I'd like to talk to you about fine particle pollution. Fine particles are so small in size that when compared to the width of a human hair, they represent only a tiny fraction. They are so small they can easily get into your lungs when you breathe. Once there, they can cause heart and breathing problems, and even death. People with asthma and respiratory illnesses, children and older adults, are most at risk. But even healthy people can suffer serious health problems, and could even die from exposure. Ecology estimates that fine particle pollution in Washington kills over 1,100 people and adds about 200 million in health care costs every single year. By now, we all know how bad cigarette smoke is for our health. What many people don't know is that breathing smoke from burning wood and yard debris is a lot like breathing cigarette smoke. And breathing toxic particles in diesel engine exhaust can cause cancer. Fine particle pollution comes from a number of different sources. The majority of it comes from smoke associated with burning wood for home heating in wood stoves and fireplaces. Right now, areas of Tacoma and Pierce County don't meet federal standards for fine particle levels, mainly because of wood smoke. Fine particle pollution also comes from burning crop residue on farms, wildfires, and residential burning, which is banned in many areas of the state. Residential burning also includes the use of burn barrels, which are illegal everywhere in the state. And then there's fine particle pollution that comes from engine exhaust cars, large trucks and other heavy equipment, trains, aircraft, and ships are all common sources. That's a lot of pollution, but Ecology and its partners are working hard to clean up the air we all breathe. Washington State's wood stove pollution standards are some of the most protective of human health in the entire nation, and they are also more protective than the federal government's own standards. The Department of Ecology and local air agencies offer financial help to replace older, higher polluting devices. We also ban the use of wood stoves when smoke puts people at risk. And we work with local clean air agencies and other partners to make diesel engines cleaner. There are some simple things you can do to protect yourself from breathing fine particles. If you burn wood to heat your home, make sure the wood is dry and seasoned. Use proper burning techniques. Make sure your wood stove meets Washington standards. If you have an old wood stove, check with Ecology or your local clean air agency to see if you can take advantage of exchange programs so you can get a new, cleaner burning model. And please, always pay attention to burn bans. You can also drive less. And turn off your vehicle's engine when you're waiting in a line or in a parking lot. And support efforts to clean up the air you breathe. The Air Quality Program and our partners measure fine particle pollution levels around the state to see how much pollution people may be breathing. You can find health information about current pollution levels on Ecology's website. Just look at the monitoring sites closest to where you are to see what pollution levels are like. Ecology and its partners want to make sure that every Washington citizen has healthy air to breathe, but cleaning up the air won't happen overnight. You can help. By working together, we can clean Washington's air. Be the difference and breathe the difference.